One of the fun things to do inside Substance Painter is to apply bitmap textures on your meshes. So in lesson 14, we will see how we can do that. So in lesson 14, we'll see how we can put a texture uh, bitmap file on any of the surface. Okay, so let's start by going at the back of the television this time. So I will go to the back casing texture set. Okay, we don't have anything yet because we have not worked on it yet. So what I will do here is that I will make a new fill layer. So once I have the new fill layer, what I will do here is that I will go to my uh, shelf and I will search for the uh, servlet here. So I have the servlet. Okay. Also, I have the back sticker, but back sticker is quite wide and it's a PNG. So I think the better one is the servlet. Okay. So I will take the servlet, drag and drop it in the base color. Okay. And you can see everything is there but you can see it's too big and it's too huge first of all what i will do here is that i will create a mask mat uh, add mask with a color pick the color and i will pick this color because here is where i want my uh like a sticker to be the servlet to be okay now here's uh i have it but it's upside down and it is quite big so what i can do here is that i will go to this uh layer okay the fill layer and i'll scroll up okay instead of uv projection i will use planar projection and then i will turn on my uh manipulator and i will try to uh, choose the surface tool and click over here okay i will take this one click it here it's too Big. so I will take my scale tool scale it up and you can see it is uh, upside down and also it is repeating so I will uh, scale it up first then I will take the rotation press shift key and rotate so it will stay on the right angles now I have rotated but the thing is that it is other way around means like it is left to right so I will press shift key again and I will take this to this side now it's fine uh, but uh, we need to further adjust it but before doing that I have to go to UV wrap and make the repetition none it's quite annoying okay so I will take this uh, scaling tool okay start to scale it up I think it's again it got rotated okay uh, but don't worry we'll see how to fix that and I will adjust this whole thing just like this okay move it a little bit up and then just like this you can change it now let me rotate it here okay didn't got rotated why what is the reason it's not rotating let me try rotating in this form okay and then i will try to rotate again let me rotate without shift key okay now i will snap now it's fine i think the snap the shift key the snapping was actually messing around that's why i was not able to do that now you can see we have the sticker over here okay uh you can see that it's quite uh, low uh like uh you can say resolution here the reason is that if you i will go to texture set you can see i'm using 1024 if i will change it to 4096 so the quality will be much more better now you can see it's very crisp but it will make my computer a little slow so that's why i will keep it to 1024 in the end i can change it back okay so this is how you can put uh like uh, textures or you can say bitmaps on any one of the surface so this is how you can do that it's fun putting these uh like textures to the items like uh, you know like we did over here so guys i hope you have 
uh, now know how to uh, put the sticker so you can start putting uh, these kind of uh, texture maps wherever you want okay inside your substance painter so take care we will do more of these in the next class okay and uh, there are a lot of new stuff coming up so please don't forget to click on the subscription button also click on the bell icon watch my videos online and guys take a very good care of yourself and see you next time in lesson 15. Thank you.